Hello everyone, back to Limbus. Welcome. There's a group of staff walking this way, carrying an imposing aura. Unlike any other K Corp, these must be the Super K Corps. Yeah, some of you haven't evacuated. They ignored the words, went out. Okay, fair. We're not intruders, right? Okay. Class 1. The highest. Just like grade 1. Makes. Yeah, that's why they're the noblest. Class 1 is the lowest. Higher is better ranks. <laughs> yeah, how are they divided? Alright. Okay. Okay, three and a half days of overtime report work. Okay. Screening room. Convoluted, okay. Okay. Underground or highest? Or would the middle point be the best? Here we go. As you might have seen earlier, that's Marl. In fact, I met him once at a job interview for B Corp. Who's B Corp again? I don't have... Oh, wait, that's... A, B, right. A, B, C. The Arbiters, the Beholders, the Claws. Look, I, I'm not 100% um, memorizing all the lore. I did remember it. Gosh, I didn't I didn't memorize it all, okay? You applied for B Corp. You wanted to both be beholders? Okay, look, you're big shots, but not that big. Like and the big shot scale, you're kinda low. You're like head researcher. Is that even really a big shot in this universe? You actually have to work. K Corp was your primary choice. A man of mediocrity like me has to send an application to every wing in hopes that one will accept it. Makes sense. Marley. Appalling. Wouldn't even begin to describe their state. Oh dear, pardon me. I need to use the restroom. But are you actually affected? Or are you just pretending? They imply that you're more emotional than you act. But that could just be a facade. Yeah, they weren't able to fight back. <laughs> they didn't see no problem fighting us. I mean, maybe, but like, you're attacking civilians. Should you like wipe out the military there? I mean, I guess killing civilians will leave a message, but like, I don't know, it seems a little messed up. You're complaining about your civilians being killed, so you kill civilians back. That's just how you get civilians to hate you. Yeah, where's your boss? Are you still alive? <laughs> Bomb did hurt a bit. It was a means. Unexpected variable. Yeah, there is. Boss broke the silence. Yeah, Faust is correct on that. Getting rid of technology, it might bring a peace, but it's not the peace they seek. Yeah. <laughs> Trips to the back streets were trending among the rich. I remember a trend a while ago where it was like, I'm homeless for a day. These people would, like, quote-unquote, be homeless. Sometimes they even take resources from, like, actual homeless people. When they didn't actually need them. I think the only way I'd be okay with them taking resources is then they actually were verifiably donated much more than they took. But, you know, most people probably aren't going to donate. If they do, they're just pretending. 
Will you experience take another look at their lives and be thankful for everything they have? Yeah, most of them would just kind of perish. And? I don't like talking to people. Not fond of explaining things. Oh, wow. You're just going to tell Faust that you don't want to have to talk to someone as dumb as her? Is that what you're saying? I don't think Faust would like that. I'm not talk to absurd, and I don't require explanations in any field. I was simply curious to know the difference in perspectives. None of us take warp trains. Well, that's that's good for you. Like that that like I'm not being sarcastic. There. That's literally good for you. We don't eat the meat. Eat the city has to offer. Well, yeah, you said you don't use warp trains. That means you don't eat the meat. You know the truth. You wouldn't even consider something as shallow as backstreet trips. I mean, that's the tough thing, right? If, even if you know how a warp train works, you still might have to take them. And taking them, you might know the evils of them. But you're going to come out fine, right? So what's what's the problem? What's a few million years of pain if you aren't even going to remember it? Okay. Yeah. The elders of my family who must know even greater things than I do didn't have any problem, though. The masses are ignorant. They won't believe it even if you show it before their eyes. Is your conclusion? Kill innocents? Yeah, like, I feel like they really do want to do something good based off of what they're saying. But they are super going about it the wrong way. This, this isn't going to work out. Like, I'm sorry to say. You wouldn't get? No, I think I get just fine. Yeah, Heathcliff, look at the scars on this person's body and tell me. Tell me, look at this man's body. Look at all these scars. And really, just tell me that he does not know struggle and pain. Like, he knows something. He knows some stuff. You cannot tell me that Heathcliff was in a wing his whole life and never had to go through any difficulties. <laughs> there are plenty of blighters out there who just don't get it if you talk nicely. They only start emphasizing the likes of me after they get a couple bruises and scars on their faces. Yeah. Gives me the urge to just wreck it all. If we ever recruit new members, I'll try excluding the educational background from the requisites. <laughs> Heath school never t Heathcliff never told us what schools he went to. I can see where it's coming from. Still, you're going way over the line. <laughs> Alright, and here's the boss of 669 health. Pretty strong looking. Though, I don't think it'll matter once Heathcliff goes into full power. There we go. Okay. EY. What does every... AU? A? What, you sang? What's the relationship? Long been severed. I hate speaking for long even more. <laughs> okay. The smile's annoying. Uh-huh. Add your name. Interesting. Yeah, baffled. It's not. I'm just baffled. <laughs> yeah, Ryu can uh, say one word explanation. Or <laughs> used to work on a ship for a long time as a fixer. You have serious illusions about wings and firms. You dump your common sense in the lake as chum. Bring up morality in the world we live in. Pretty amusing as a joke. And hunting and changing jobs between firms are based on interest and efficiency. 
Boat Billy? <laughs> this really is strange. I'm not taking you saying thoughts into account at all. Thoughts are rather meeker things. Taxidermy. Okay, <laughs> fine. Actually, didn't all of us receive the same offer? The job offer. In my case, I'd been promised I'd get my aspect carved. I'd barely remember a thing, but as soon as I heard that word, I nod not as, as if I was possessed. They acted like they knew my only choice would be to accept it. Mm -hmm. thing I wished for dearly. The thing I recited to myself every night. Thing I thought would be impossible. They promised to make it a possibility, most certainly. How thoroughly did they look into our backgrounds? I'm kind of curious what everyone's deepest wish is. Does Sinclair want to be strong? Does Sinclair want revenge? Does Sin Sinclair want his family? I don't think it's revenge. I don't think Sinclair craved revenge. It just doesn't seem as in what I've seen of Sinclair. I think ultimately it'll probably boil down to he either wants his family back or what I think is more like he wanted to be strong. Not, not imposing on others strong, just he wanted to be independent, be able to not be weak. But who knows? Maybe he just wanted Cromer. <laughs> uh, our own wish granting tales. No more than futile dreams. Are you joining them? Walked for so long that my feet hurt. And a shower of rain was pouring down as well. The bus I saw then appeared rather inviting. It can't be it, can it? We all. That's enough of it. Our company rules forbid disclosing the contents of the job contract in detail. <laughs> the same boat. Foul. The way her eyes glow. Okay. Do Dawn and Ryo's eyes actually glow? Like, is that an augment or just a mutation? <laughs> I'm kind of curious. Or, or is that just for style? Honestly, I'd believe it's actually physically happening for some reason. Let's proceed. That's when a thought struck me. Unlike most other sinners, he's saying wouldn't vocalize his pain. Because of that, I'd often discover his injury is light. Where has he been holding all that pain? I was reminding the void in his chest I caught a glimpse of. Was he keeping it in or was it spilling out? I think this is probably a good time for me to stop for now. I'll definitely continue later, but for now, I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.